My life is about to change. <laughs> uh. Well, that's embarrassing. Just calling back. Hello. 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 Why is it dark? Cause I fell asleep. I told you. <laughs> what are you doing? Okay. Wake up, y'all. This is. She was saying I need to be here. We're going out. <laughs> this, that, and the third. You're on and camera. Don't play with me. Hey, friends. We just got into the hotel. Literally so tired right now. But still got to show you the room. Say hi to the friend. Hi, guys. What? <laughs> I don't know. She's a little shy right now. Okay. Look at the room. How cute is this? And look at this view. More Empire State Building. I can't really see the Empire State Building, but um, it's a cute V. It's called Public Hotel. So whenever you're in New York, whenever you're in New York, come check it out. They look cute. Yeah. Good morning. Hey, so look at the fact she's actually saying hi to you guys today. <laughs> Hello, hi guys, how are y'all? Nice to meet nice you. You know what I mean? Yeah. Champagne. <laughs> y'all, I'm French. Oui, oui. Oui, oui. Anyway, we are actually in New York. Yeah. Yesterday we had to go eat after we got in. It's not too cold. You know what I mean? I feel like I brought a lot of clothes for the cold weather. But I'm gonna still make same shape, you know what yeah. I mean? I'm gonna still look good. Period. I'm probably lying. I feel like I have like 80 bitty skirts in my bag. Yeah. Gotta go meet up with one of my friends that came from London. A fresh babe. <laughs> British babe. It's a British babe. Oh, wait, wait. We have to do our accent today. Yeah. Like, whole day. Yeah, whole day. Yeah. <laughs> Yo. Uh, We're going um, fabric shopping, and I'm not gonna put the fabric shopping in this video, but I'm gonna put it in a different video. So y'all can watch that. It's gonna be so entertaining, don't you think? Yeah, tap in, y'all. Tap in. Did they say that over there? I don't know. <laughs> real uncle, real raw. July me, bitch. Period. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what accent was that one? <laughs> that was not. I really don't know. <laughs> oh my god, what kind of fucking shower? Bro, you see, it has a power button. Bro, power I mean, button. I mean, we love the hotel, guys. And we love it! We love it! <laughs> Sponsor us! Y'all, okay, so I just did my makeup, you know? We can't tell if it's hot or cold. But look at how we gonna check the temperature. Like, we opened the little crack in the window. <laughs> Bro, like, I still feel like my little ass could slip through this thing. Like, this is too big of an opening. This is the fit. You can't really see the sweater I have on under. It's pretty cute. But, yeah, I just put this on over just because it's a little chilly right now. My Zara booties. Pam. Y'all, I'm here with the one and only Period. Marianne. Period. This is my London friend I was telling you guys about earlier. And um, hey guys, can't you just see the accent? Here she is from Essex. I am from London, dear. Oh, you know, I I am the fifth cousin twice removed of the Queen. Of the Queen. Of the Queen. As you can see, the resemblance. As you, you like to, <laughs> can you not see my skin? Of yeah. Of course, I'm royalty, darling. The Queen had that lace front. <laughs> the Queen had that lace front. She had the lace front. <laughs> she got a new mayor, y'all. Mm -hmm. And he's rich. He's got properties. Properties. Wait, really? Like in London? Mm -hmm. Multiple. Really? Here, is he black? Of course. <laughs> Why do you say of course? Exclusively black, sweetheart. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Honestly, I don't care. Really? So Jeff Bezos, Omar, I did. <laughs> we are off to Brooklyn Museum. Yes. Muglia. Muglia. This is one of my favorite designers, y'all. Like, I, I get so much inspiration from Muglia. It's like so feminine. Yeah. Risky. The way it just contours the body. Yes. Muglia, I'm coming for you. That's literally Kylie's dress. Well, Muglia. But Kylie wore this. Fan girling right now. One day. One day. One day. One day. We're, we're gonna have a, a exhibit for us. Period. Ta, what's we still here? Yes, what's still here? Yeah. Me glad. Yeah. Remember that here? Ten out of ten. Me Stunning. Oh my god, the ring. The, the me glad star. 
so cute. I just love fashion and it evokes so much emotions in me. Well, didn't, didn't um, Zendaya wear something similar to this like for a red carpet? This is the mind of one person. Obviously, yeah, help. But still, I'm praying for this much creativity. This is so inspiring. Wow. Look at the waist. Skinny, just like me. Just like me, mommy. The waist, the waist is matching. The waist. Is it the same waist? Yes, exactly. Exact same waist, yeah. Y'all let us know where to go eat at in Brooklyn. No, I would've had about 10 meals in New York by now. She just said Nigerian for this bro. I feel the same class. I'm just not, I don't like the way it looks. Suya is like a stew, right? No, Suya is like spicy, <laughs> spicy kebab. I don't like the way that it looks. Oh, that sounds good. Like beef okay, it doesn't look good, but it tastes good. I don't believe it. I don't you like never it. You never even tried it? No. Japanese what do you like from food. Zimbabwe? I like my food. Like, what is it called? It's called Sata. What is it? What does it look like? Maize meal. It doesn't look any better, does it? It does look way better, actually. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Ain't nobody heard about that. <laughs> no, why my ass look fat in this? Oh my god. I was telling you. Pumpkin. I was telling you. We love that. This would have been crazy. Tiare Mugla. 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 Y'all, we just Mugla. left the museum. Mm -hmm. 10 out of 10. Amazing experience. I loved it. Yes. If you're in Brooklyn, New York. You definitely have to. It Ends the seventh of May. Yes, ends May seventh. Y'all should check it's it out. It's a lot of time. He should have had it when he was alive, but you know what I mean. Flowers are flowers. Flowers. They don't flowers. like to honor you till you're dead. Um. <laughs> yes. <It's laughs> I mean, though. he still got his props. It's true. He did. He, he did. did. Just changed into a different fit. We're about to go get some drinks real quick. Period. This is fit number two today. Let's talk about it. Yeah. And it's gonna be one more oh, before we go out. Uh -huh. <laughs> Oh, we're on the way to Soho House because we I was supposed to go link up one of my friends. My friends is in the Bronx right now. Who's going to the Bronx? Who's going, going to the Bronx, Who's going to the Bronx? It's like an hour to Bronx. get there right now. The Bronx is like 10 miles away. Why is it an hour to get there? That's crazy. That would have been a smooth five minutes for me. Oh god. Like, Wait, are you a fast driver? Yeah. Yeah, you are, right? Yeah, yeah. NASCAR driver. NASCAR. You certified. I'm not. He be honking at me in the Houston truck. Really? <laughs> no, they don't be honking. No. But when it's like rush hour, yeah, yeah, I'm yeah, yeah, zooming yeah. in that bitch. Like y'all, everybody's pissing me off. I want to drive that maybe. Yeah, girl, you should. And, uh, what kind of car you want? A nice car. I don't know what that means. Uh, <laughs> oh, you're not into cars? Car. Nah. You're not into cars? But I just know I, don't, I want a big boy. G-Wagon vibes. Ah. I, I want a big boy car. Like, a, like a I Urus. To... I want a Urus. Oh, I don't even know what that looks a lamb. like. A Lamb? A Lambo. Yeah. Yeah, my friend has a Lambo. Yeah, like the, that's the small ones though. Like the sports car. The small mm -hmm. tiny one on yeah. the ground? Okay, yeah. those are really cute. I was like, mm -mm. You don't like it? I'd rather have a Bentley Ooh, over a Porsche. Yeah, yeah like Aaliyah's car is young. And, oh yeah. my God, Aaliyah, if you see this. <laughs> <laughs> I'm acting like a chicken. <laughs> oh, <laughs> dang. That's your whole girl. Talk Wait, about it, Gora. Who texts me? Everybody wanted, oh no. Nobody me. <laughs> Embarrassed. Oh my gosh, she's like, everybody texting me. <laughs> Meanwhile, ain't no everybody. He took that long. I'm gonna take two times that long. Time Ladies, that whenever long. a man Don't takes two minutes to text you, Don't take 2,000 hours to text him back. Period. Because if he really liked you, he would be holding the phone waiting for you to text back. Literally. You know what I mean? Take my advice on this one. If you don't hear nothing else from this video, take my advice on that one. No, but one thing I will say, though, a man that takes like two seconds to text you back is jobless. <laughs> Right. Right. So what do we want though? We acting like we sure. we, need, we need in between. So yeah. you can't take like five hours to respond. And you can't take two minutes. You but I understand take like you got, minutes to an I need hour. you to have a board meeting to go to, honey. Yeah, so I understand. I'm sorry, babe. I'm so busy. I'm gonna call you right after. Yeah, let's. I'm just leaving this thing running. Bro, this vlog is supposed to be like 30 minutes. I'm thinking it's really 30 minutes. But honestly, if it's an hour, it's I an hour. An hour. It's I love an hour vlog. Really? Yeah. Okay. I don't know. Like, do you guys really like me like that? Comment. Put it in the comments below. Like, <laughs> which, like I guess how I, I feel like YouTube, I can actually like say my business because like I feel like if you actually want to click my video, that means you care about what I have to say for an hour. Because yeah. like, you know, I wouldn't no one, want no one's annoying voice playing for an hour. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's You true. know what I mean? So it's like, I, I get why people really. talk to like the camera and say their business a little bit more yeah, on YouTube. Yeah, yeah. 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 People yeah. do really talk with you. Well, some people are weird and they hate you and they're gonna watch you like Yeah, but yeah. But they're fine anyway. So. Yeah. You help me out anyway. Okay. There probably are people that don't like it, but they're they're watching every move. <laughs> watch, I'm gonna watch. Watch well. Take the notes. Take the note. I'm not, I'm not even a rude babe, but like, if you're trying to be rude to me, 
I go show you pepper. <laughs> show you pepper like this. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, we are at a pasta restaurant right now. It's called a pasta, a pasta bar. bar. A pasta bar. How original. But they cook it in front of you, so look at this. I'm waiting for them to cook it in front of me, so my turn is coming soon. I'm gonna let you know if it's good or not. I'm be for real. I'm be like that guy on TikTok, Keith. You know him? Yeah. Yeah. The serious guy. So I decided to come to this pasta restaurant. I don't really do pasta, but I'll let you know what it I think. You know what I mean? Coming back with a review. I'm gonna scale it one to ten. Well, they just made our food in front of us. Uh, look how cute. I got clam. She got something spicy. That's so cute. Marianne got something spicy. I don't know. Is it spicy? I don't know. It's not spicy? Oh, okay. Yeah, look at how they're making it, y'all. So cute. Y'all should 100% come here. It's good. Yeah. I like mine. Do you like yours? Mm -hmm. First bite. Love clam. So uh, I miss her right now. Shout out to real sis. Shout out to her. Put up your favorite friendly No, it's like women women and don't pay for anything. Amen. You know what I mean? That's my belief. That's, that's I thought it was weird. Whenever I went to London, we were like, oh you gotta buy a ticket for recess. Ticket for recess. I should be walk ushered into the, the, the venue. You know what I mean? Americans, we don't pay for it. Yeah, women don't pay for anything. Even the gay boys don't pay for nothing. That's messed up. He's trying clam for the first time. Try. Public, yeah, to the Bronx, to the Bronx, and back to public, back to public. Then we outside. Then we outside. <laughs> I'm going to the big Bronx. Did it from my car? Somebody, if you're friends, say anything, child. No. Jibbe is woman says I need. Like, yeah, Jibbe is woman. I need, but afterwards you were just on clap, clap, a walk, clap, a walk. <laughs> Bro, this SD card has been working for me. Yeah, yeah I need that. Can you get those tattoos done? And she gonna look you up and down. Yeah, like, I need that. True. Yeah. And she never gonna see you again. She will. Never she will act like she's in love. Yeah. Like, that's actually the point. She's gonna flirt. The thing is, you was so much like, we talked about the hell. Y'all just seen him? I'm, yeah, I'm a very friendly ass person. Bloody ass person. <laughs> Why don't you like Patty? This is me and Patty. This is me and Patty, guys. Some random girls took it. I was on a solo trip. These girls took it from me and hit that hole. I'm a friendly ass bitch. Period. Gotcha. But it's because it's Bitcoin. He's like, Grazie. Can you speak in Italian to me? He's calling me Bella. Bella Hadi. Okay, this is outfit number three of the day. Look at the fit. Look at the material. Y'all, okay, this is not really a good mirror, but you can kind of get the flow. Yeah. Yeah, hold on, I'm gonna pop the camera up. This is Kavali. Me. Okay. A cat. Yeah. Yeah. Good morning. It's full day two. Last night was chill or whatever. How did you have fun? Yeah, it was a chill time. It was chill. It was chill. New York is always a vibe. Like honestly, like just being out here is a. Oh, y'all looking at the room. <laughs> <laughs> it's so messy. But just being out here is a vibe on its own. Like yeah. So today we're um we're gonna go to a pop up for this influencer. Her name is Colleen Diaz. I don't. She's really popular. Like, the, one of the best fashion girlies, killing it right now. So she's having a jewelry pop up. So we're gonna go do that, get some drinks, and meet up with a few photographers, and, and link up with some of our other friends. So, but yeah, I'm gonna get ready, put a fit on, and you know, y'all, it's actually kind of cold here, and I hate the cold. I literally do not do the cold. So it's really annoying that it's like 40 degrees. Like I can't take it, but it's okay. I'm gonna still look cute. I'm gonna still get the content, do what I need to do, but I'm gonna have a coat on me at all times. 
See y'all in the next clip. Okay, y'all, we having girl talk, so I'm gonna let y'all listen because this tea right now. It's gonna be a little bit tilted, but y'all just gonna have to live with it, okay? Okay, okay. Men, oh, men just men liars. They're liars. The like, biggest liars. The biggest liars. They're literally liars. Pathological lie. liars. I feel like they're just pathological liars and they don't feel guilt when they lie. It's just secondhand nature to them. So it's just like something they don't even think about. Most times they just lie off bat. But why do you like want to treat somebody badly? You know it's what I they're mean? They're not good people. And you can't like you can't expect people to be good people. Yeah, definitely. A lot of people haven't. They don't have morals. And even if their parents try to like raise them the right way, they're just dude, they think it's so cool to like you know disrespect girls and yeah in a type of way because they think that gets them like cool points. Like I feel like they do that stuff to like you know. Yeah. Tell their guys, oh yeah, like you know, this is not like try to you know hype themselves up. Yeah. They want the validation of men. They do. They want the acceptance of men. So treating girls like shit, that gives them you know like points. They're like, like okay, my home, my older homeboy did it, so I can do it too. Like yeah, yeah, yeah. Like he, he, he's the shit. So and he be treating girls like this, so I'm gonna do that too. But like, why? Like I imagine you would think you would think with age, like the older they get, like. They're actually gonna change and be different. Nah, the niggas never change. <laughs> they never change. Never, like, that's how you are, that's how you are. And they even get worse when you get older. Because now they have money and they can be rude. Yeah. Bro, at that point, stop moving older. to girls. Stop moving to girls. Like, move to your homeboys. Like, the thing is, that's what they really want to do. <laughs> And that's the main thing. <laughs> the guys who treat girls this badly, this badly, they're, like, they're like I understand, DL. I understand a little bit bad, like a little bit bad, but really bad, like really shitty, like unrespectful, like the fact that you don't even, you have a mother, like you know what I mean, like that badly. Oh my God, you are looking for your homeboys. Yeah. Ugh. It doesn't matter if they have a sister. It doesn't matter if they have a mom. It doesn't matter, bro. And a lot of the times, it's like guys actually also following in their father's footsteps as well. If their dad isn't shit, they're definitely not gonna be shit. Especially if they don't even have a dad, they don't know how to treat a woman. So those are most of the guys, like the guys that don't have like a dad, they're gonna be the ones that don't open the door for you. They're gonna be the ones Bad. that don't know how to treat you, don't know how to be a gentleman, because they were never taught that. Of course, there's always gonna be people that just ain't shit, you know? You can't yeah, some people are just naturally not shit. Like, you can, they can come from the best family. Yeah. They're still not shit. Yeah, so it's just really like, it just depends on the person. It's like case by case basis. Oh, that light looks good. Yeah. Ooh. Where's T? We on our way. We're late to Miss Colleen. Yeah, we're late because of you guys. Yeah. When is she never? No, I'm kidding. Let me, no. let me <laughs> not throw her under the bus because we both be having our moments. We do. But, oh my God. I'm in New York. Nobody talks about how hard it is to post in real time when you're out on vacation. Like, I really want to post right now. It's like Saturday. I like posting on Saturdays. And it's like, I like to be at peace in my house, in my bonnet. Damn, post a phone by You know what I mean? Yeah, like, definitely. Bro, you lot that can. I feel like the pictures that you can just post like that are like photographer pics. Bro, yeah, can, definitely. Can, can you text that guy? I need pictures yeah. right now. I like, I need to drop them too, ones. I, I want to drop those. I'd rather drop those in like some mid. You know what I yeah. mean? Be consistent, but don't drop no mid either. <laughs> <laughs> like necklace thrifted necklaces aren't really trendy right now but guess what it look cute on me so i'm gonna put it on you feel me yo i need to stop looking in the viewfinder i promise i'm gonna learn to start looking in the camera so i feel like y'all can feel like me i'm right here with y'all okay bro why are we just getting out of the apartment or the hotel at three this we left early yesterday though did we yes we did we were out all day yeah we were i feel like you need to go to these modeling agencies on like a when it's not busy season. Monday, Tuesday. Yeah, no, no, no. Not right now, not though. Right, not right now. Not during fashion week. Do not go during fashion week. Go like May, come back to New York, May, summertime, yeah. maybe like April. I want to come back anyways in the summertime. When stuff is, is quiet, come back yeah. and like do the modeling, like scouting stuff. Cause yeah. I feel like right now, though, they would not pay you no mind because everybody's trying to, yeah, everybody's trying to get signed. You know what I mean? Unless you look like freaking Naomi Campbell. Mm -hmm. But you do. Period. <laughs> Y'all, we are yeah. I just got my own yeah. okay. That's crazy. so embarrassing. <laughs> we gotta redo that, we gotta redo that. Okay, okay y'all, look how many people this. And then Colleen's over there, like, doing a little meet and greet, so we're gonna meet her. But they're playing music right now, so goodbye. Mm -hmm. We got the like a lot. Look at this. Look at the wall. Super cute. Yeah, yeah. We're just talking about my, what is it? One million subscribers? One million subscribers. Yeah, yeah. 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 we're gonna have a party just like this. Look at this. We're gonna have all this set up here. One million subscribers, almost there. Make sure you subscribe.
We're at Coast Hall right now, and like we want to talk. We want to talk. Um, she's supposed to speak her language. So, all right, how do we say rich man? Nin or large button? What? Nin. Nin. Or. Or. Large button. Large button. Large. Black. But then. But then. Nin or like but then. Yeah, nin or like. I see butter. many nin or like but then around me. <laughs> <laughs> many nin or like but then. Oh my god, I need to show them what we got. Yeah. Okay, we'll do a mini, mini, uh. What is it called? Haul. Mini haul. <laughs> you two are bro, 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 bro. I'm sorry. Yeah, we got some cute stuff, guys. From the pop up. This is the bag that we came in. We got three things. One of them was a free gift. It's really cute. Guess what we got? Espresso martinis. The first martinis in espresso. That's liquor. That's liquor. That's liquor. Ooh, that's liquor. <laughs> wow, we eating real good tonight. I'm gonna show y'all. I'm gonna show y'all in a little bit, but we are feasting. The girls are no longer skinny. No more skinny girls. No more skinny. The waist is gone. It's not existing. Well, what? Well, no, the waist is gonna be there. It's gonna be existing. The waist is existing. The waist is existing. <laughs> Unfortunately, so you know what I mean. Big waist, little waist. You love yourself. Be confident. You know what I mean. That's the key. Like we were just talking about, just like, be, like focus on your own self. Like. Comparison to things of joy. You feel like you look good and you know you look good. Who cares what anyone thinks? Like, your waist don't gotta be size 20 for you to feel like you can wear a certain outfit. Put that outfit on. Don't do what everybody else is doing. If you think something is cute, just wear it. Wear it. Like, that's just you can do. Yeah. You're gonna be inspiring other people in the process. You know what I mean? Of course, they feel weird at the beginning. Put that outfit on. Show it off. Express to yourself. <laughs> I'm about to take a picture right now and post it on my story, y'all. Yeah, if you see this, make sure you let me know in the comments if you're watching my stories. Cheers! Danke schön. Why am I speaking Dutch? And like, I really want to learn how to speak multiple languages. Like, right now I'm learning French. Um, pas le français en particulier. But, you know, I'm my French instructor. She better be watching my French instructor, Eva. She's helping me out, you know. We're gonna go out later. And we're gonna, like, went to Houston, we're gonna go out. And we're gonna have chats and chats and chats in French. So, yeah. I got some, what did I get? Chicken? Uh, yeah. Um, you got chicken too. And then some fried rice. Ooh. Y'all look, she giving me a, took my breast milk like liquor and fried rice. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I wanna go do a little talking and mingling and whatnot. You know my friendly ass gotta, I can't, I can't leave the building without saying hello to everybody. <laughs> no, we gotta go with dead eyes. Like, if you know me, you know I'm gonna like, Track of a conversation with anybody. Oh my god, we be walking and we're just walking. Daddy will stop like five people. Oh my god, I love this. I love that. You're so cute. This that. I'm like, oh, like that's cute. But, like Daddy, let's go. We're gonna be late. Like, bro, literally. Let's go. Like, it's literally. not the time right now. Literally, I'm just gonna start talking to anyone. I don't know. I love that. Like, people just have to know. Like, I'm a talker. So if you see me, I'm never I'm too ill to say what's up. Like, I might, I might meet mug in my photos. <laughs> All love, peace and rainbows here. You guys, uh, if I already started partying without me, she left without me. I'm literally wearing the same thing I was wearing earlier, but I just put on some pants and some sneakers just because I want to be a little bit comfy tonight. Like, I'm trying to be out and about on the town. You feel me? And I want to be, you feel me? With these heels on, I can't really do that. I'm trying to be drizzunk. 
Not drunk. I'm trying to be drizzy, drizzy, ir, 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 ir. drunk. You feel me? Like, I'm trying to be aced. What did I tell him to say? I don't know what he said, but there's a club literally right upstairs. So it's like so convenient. And she's already there. We met some cool people. Honestly, I'm gonna try and record them. Hopefully, they don't act weird when I'm recording them. But they seem chill, they seem cool. They're a little young though, but I don't care. If you lit, you lit. I'm gonna party with you, I'm gonna rock with you. So, yeah. See y'all. Y'all say hi. Are we out here. We all say. <laughs> okay, we came back to the room because y'all saw how it was so cold up there. Look at this puffer. Oh. I got this puffer on. Yeah. Got the puffer on. You know, are you are you from New York even? Yeah. Yeah. You finna be skirting and skirting around the city. Yo, Marianne needs to wake up. Y'all. I need everyone to go to Marianne's Instagram and tell her <laughs> how can you do this to us? She just fell asleep on it. But to be fair, she didn't sleep the whole night. And in the morning she didn't sleep neither. Let's call her again. Marianne UK. Say hi guys. Say hi, friends. Hi, babies. Yo, after like five rings, I gotta hang up. You know what I mean? <laughs> but no, if after it, three, four rings. If it was a man, if it was a man. If it's my friend, I'm let that shit ring out. Yeah. If it's a, if it's a man, three rings. Three, two, three rings, and I'm, I'm holding it. <laughs> like bro, at that point, I'm begging. After three, four rings, you're begging. Like literally. Never call a man and let it ring more than three, four times. Yeah, if that, like. Y'all, it's three fifty-three a.m. Taking our ass home. Say home. Home. Let's <laughs> go, go. No, New York was lit. It was so lit. Y'all, oh my God, look at the jewelry that I got from Anhu. Anhu? Is it Anhu or Enra? I think it's Enra. <laughs> you from ass bitch. Sorry, I'm French. <laughs> wow. Quit playing with me. Let me. Oh my God, I'm giving y'all a show. Oh. Oh, this is Kafar's. Can I show them? Yeah. You guys, look at what she got. Ooh. So cute. This is hard. Okay, y'all wanna see my ink? And I love the detailing. It's like molecule something, something, something. Anyways, y'all should cop it. But yeah, thank y'all for tuning in to the vlog. Honestly, being in New York was so lit. But you know me, I'm ready to get back to work and get back to, you know, being consistent and being on my grind. I just feel like sometimes a trip can really just like hit your routine. You know, I just love a routine. I love doing the same thing every single day. And like, obviously that's the same thing, but I have a to-do list. But, you know, bye friends. Let us know in the comments your favorite part of the vlog. Yes, let us know your favorite part of the vlog. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Like, yeah. comment, subscribe. Don't be lame. Don't be lame. Don't yeah. be lame. Ooh, I'm showing y'all the whole room. And we'll be. And we'll be. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, don't do that. All right, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a link with y'all. Bye.